In this tutorial we are going to learn how to use the Orbit tool. The Orbit tool belongs to the camera toolbar and if your camera toolbar is not turned on go to view toolbars and turn on the camera tools. So what we first need to do is have something to uh, look at um, and an easy way without drawing anything is to just get something from the 3D warehouse. So from the warehouse toolbar we can click on get models then in the get models search pane here we could um, type in field museum of natural history click on the little thumbnail then we can just click on download then it will ask, would you like to download this directly into your SketchUp model? Uh, just say yes. Okay, and now you have it. So, let's look at the Orbit tool. You need to click on it to make it active. Then what you do is you left click and drag your finger upwards to bring the view down and then release start again click at the bottom drag it up then release if you want to then spin around to the uh, left you would then left click at the left of the screen drag it to the right release left click at the left hand side drag release and vice versa if you want to go back the other way you would left click at the right of the screen drag it to the left and release if we would like to orbit um, around the front of the building looking a little bit closer at it we can use the scroll wheel on our mouse to roll forward and we can obviously roll backwards and a good thing to keep in mind is that if you want to zoom into a particular area put your cursor on where you want to go so let's say I want to zoom into the beginning of the stairs here I can then zoom in by keeping my cursor on that point and it will roll to that point similar if we want to zoom out we can um, put the cursor where we don't want to be so let's say it's in the top right corner and if we zoom out the model will go to where my cursor is so if I put it down into the bottom left corner and zoom out it will start to pull it down towards my cursor eventually. So now back at the, the front of the building, um, it's also good to, um, if you want to pivot around a particular point, click on that point. So let's say uh, it's the apex for example here, um, I would left click with the orbit tool and that's now the pivot point for me viewing the model. So it's always good to just choose the point that you want to look around and then start to orbit. Another thing you can do is let's say you're in uh, the line tool for example and you don't always want to be going and swapping to the orbit tool um, every time you want to use it so with your mouse if you have a third wheel which is a, a wheel button uh, if you push nice and hard on that wheel you can then orbit around using your mouse and once you release that wheel you will still be in the line tool so it's really ideal if you use your mouse to to access the orbit tool it's uh, the easiest way and it's it's the quickest way try and avoid choosing this tool use your mouse instead but obviously we just want to show you what the tool does how it works and um, how you look around so just to recap uh, when you're moving the view you want to hold the orbit tool down release and then start again release start again start again release so you do it in in movements